Einstein said, ladies and gentlemen, that the world will not be destroyed by those that do evil, but by those that watch and do nothing. Einstein said, the world will not be destroyed by those who do evil, but by those who watch them and do nothing. nothing. My name is Daryl Guberman. I am the CEO of Guberman PMC LLC. I have tried as I may in the 12 years of doing business to uh, illuminate the populace. For as a Jewish man, there is a saying, a Hebrew saying, tiku olam, illuminating the world. There are so many people out there that said the Holocaust never happened. Well, let me just tell you something. We are living that Holocaust every day by doing nothing, by you doing nothing. Because people did nothing in Poland, my great-grandparents were marched down to the end of town and murdered by white people. I have to say this. You look at the continent of Africa. There is not one global, one language that all of Africa speaks. The reason why they do that is very simple. Keep the people separate so that we, the leaders, can rape them steal from them. As a matter of fact, I did some research in the Catholic Relief Services who send foodstuffs to all these countries that we give money to. Guess what happens? The leaders of these countries sell it on the open market to make cash for themselves. You look at Ukraine and you look at Russia, even look in the United States. There is not one leader that helps us. I will give you a for instance. Let me tell you, I live in Connecticut. I just got out of a meeting. That's why I'm fired up about this. It is not anger. It is common sense. Common sense, as Thomas Paine said, when speaking the truth, it is many times like administering medication to the dead. And ladies and gentlemen, we've been dead for a long time in America. We've been fat and happy for a long time. But when you see corruption and you hear people say on a daily basis, what are you going to do, Daryl? That's the way it is. Now, let me tell you about corruption in Connecticut. We have four representatives. Rosa DeLauro, Richard Blumenthal, Christopher Murphy, and Jim Himes. Four people watching over approximately 3.6 million people. Ladies and gentlemen, get your ass up. Because if you don't, these people, look at Rosa DeLora. Last time I looked, she saw over $80 million. And the, uh, the other three are unbelievable. We have suffered enough. You know, I have to say this. I watched a video the other day. Yes, on Vladimir Putin. I'm going to say this. He's a smart man. And I'm going to tell you why. Okay? Zelensky, he's a comedian. He's never had so much money. He sucked as a comedian. And he's a Jewish guy. So I'm telling you as a Jew that he, he sucked as a comedian, I'm gonna tell you this, that Vladimir Putin said this, so true. He said, you know, in the United States, <clears throat> I've been a leader here in Russia, even though it's still like the USSR, I've been a leader for three presidents. They come out with all these great and grandiose things that, that, that they're gonna change the world. And within six months, my fellow citizens, the president is impotent. No matter whether it's Democrat or Republican, Joe Biden or Donald Trump, okay? They all live great while you suffer. We suffer, okay? America, we have said, and they say that it's the best country. Yet during COVID, they couldn't keep toilet paper on the shelf. Tell me that one. They could not keep toilet paper on the shelf. Is that a great country? Is that number one? No, it's not number one. It's far from it. Yet we have our politicians who are there for 20 and 30 years doing nothing for us. Do you know, I talked about common sense. Thomas Paine said this, he said, when speaking the truth, it's many times like administering medication to the dead, as I said. I'm gonna bring this video to a close, but no matter what country you go to, okay, whether in Europe, 
whether in Asia, whether in South America or Canada, the leaders do not care about their people. I have yet to see one. And I'm 60 years old. Have you seen it? I'm going to leave it here. My name is Daryl Guberman. I am the CEO of Guberman PMC LLC, a quality consulting from here in Connecticut. Just got out of a meeting. And yes, the meeting is great. I'm gonna leave it here. My telephone number is 203-556-1493. Or you can write me at Daryl, D-A-R-Y-L, T-Q-R-S, at yahoo.com. And remember this, all of you, because many of you feel helpless and hopeless, living paycheck to paycheck. I'm going to tell you this from Confucius. It is not the droplet of water that wears away the mighty stone. But remember this, my fellow citizens, remember this, everyone in the world. And this really goes heartfelt to my dear cousin in Iran, Merdad. It is not the droplet of water that wears away the mighty stone, but it is its persistence. And Merdad, one day you and I are gonna break bread in Tehran after they get rid of the bullshit. And I thank you.